folks, this is Daily Spirit for Youth, a daily devotional that helps you grow closer to God and apply His words to your life. Today's reading entitled Special Message, written by Pastor Samuel Akihari, is based on 1 Kings 6 verses 1 until 14. I will read verse 12 and 13. As for this temple you are building, if you follow my decrees, observe my laws, and keep all my commands and obey them, I will fulfill through you the promise I gave to David your father. And I will live among the Israelites and will not abandon my people Israel. If someone is focused on their own world and in their own business, they will usually ignore things. Someone who is busy building a career may neglect other important things, such as relationships with families or even relationships with God. Today's reading shows us that in the process of building a temple, Solomon received a special message from God, so that while building the temple, Solomon can continue to connect with God. Today's reading also contains a detailed description of how Solomon was to build the temple. But there is something interesting. In the midst of the instructions given for building the temple, a special message emerges. God's warning to Solomon that he and all the Israelites should live faithfully according to God's decrees and law. In this way, God would dwell with them. This passage appears in the midst of the operational details of building the temple as a reminder that building God's house is a good thing to do, but what is far more important is living according to His ways and His will. The temple will be of no use in building the people if their lives are far from God's decrees and law. In other words, God was reminding Solomon of a priority. Folks, in the midst of hustle and bustle of building a career, a business, a brand, or everything else in between, we are reminded to continue to relate everything that we build to God. The purpose is clear. That is, it is that we don't get lost and stay on the right path according to God's decree. Don't let ourselves be getting carried away in our busyness and forget God eventually. Let us ponder these questions. 1. What special message did Solomon receive in the process of building the temple? 2. Has obedience and faithfulness to God been your priority? Please share your thoughts in the comment section below and also you can comment on other people's thoughts as well. Now let us pray. Dear Lord, please teach us to make you as our top priority. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you feel blessed through this devotional, please hit the like button and share this video with your friends, with your family, and also subscribe to this channel to receive blessings every day. God bless you.